Connectors on the thermostat. <laughs> okay, do me notes, okay, on the, on the yes, freezer, yeah. okay? Yeah, yeah, give us a shout. Yeah. Yes. Okay, thank you. Do me notes, okay? Okay, okay. Yes. Now, there we are. That's what happens when you run a repair shop and it's true to life. And get these crazy people coming. <laughs> he wants to sell me a fridge, but I sell fridges for forty pound. So the most I can do is twenty pound. You know, it's, uh, we'll have to see. Anyway, as I say, there's two screws take out the um, <coughs> thermostat there, and then there's only two spade connectors on it. Which we've put on there now. Um, always remember to, to check the plugs out because you're working with direct main voltage. There's no transformers, no isolation, no voltage dropping. It's a straight 250, 250 volts. In actual fact, your mains voltage does actually go up to 360 in places, but the main voltage is 220. Um, so let's put the crap and get on with this. Now we'll put the, um, I hope I put the right thermostat back in there, that would be funny if I stuck the old one in, wouldn't I? Talking to that nutcase. Okay. Hmm. Anyway, there we are. So there's our new thermostat. The knob has uh, got a keyway on it, so you can't get that wrong. And now we snap that back into place. There we are. And uh, remember to put our screws back in. <coughs> there's one on the floor here. Yeah. So we'll put these four screws back in here and uh, we should have a nice heater that switches on and off properly because it wasn't switching on and off before. And what we're doing here is um, <coughs> this, this appliance is uh, due to go out this morning. I've been waiting for the new thermostat to come. So our next job we've got to do is to test it and um, we'll be pack testing it as well because it is a portable appliance. Pack testing. I mean a pack tester is an Irish psychologist and uh, that, that's where they... <laughs> pack tester. <laughs> Excuse that. <clears throat> anyway, I'll get done for rice, isn't it? Um, so, the portable appliance test is basically for, if it's got a plug on it, it needs a pack test, it's as simple as that, that's the, that's the simplest way to remember it really. Um, oh, somebody's late for the lunch. Um, so we'll stick this back on here. Yeah. <laughs> And all we've got to do is bend the tags on underneath, which we'll do with our pliers. But I'm just going to screw the top in place first, so we've got that in the right position. And yep, I found the screw, which is lucky. And it's just a Phillips screw in the top there. Yeah, I sell fridges for forty pound. I sell tabletop cookers. But what's he up to out there? He stuck the fridge. What? <laughs> I don't know if he. 
One or two minutes on the on the cooker, yeah? Yeah, yeah. Okay. Yeah. Thank you very much. Okay, okay. Thank you. I'm gonna keep the lunatic sample. Right. So we'll just clamp these logs up again. So they're before. Next we've got to put back on is the uh, clamp, which is here, the long clamp. Um, It now put the spring across the bottom. That's that. And now we're in for a test. I'm going to let the oil drain down a bit. Probably have to edit this video. Because I don't want to plug it into the walls run down onto the element in case it burns it out. But this thermostat here, the contacts are jammed closed. The contacts are in here. Over there. And they're not opening and closing, it's just jammed shut. But it, it, it's all rusty. There's only two screws that hold it in. And your two spade connectors on there. And it doesn't matter which way around they go. And as I say, that thermostat there on here they've sent me is a QUATOC16. And... Um, on the piece, it's a different number on here. It looks like JU2T100. So that's the design number, and that's the reference number on the packet. And this uh, was bought. It doesn't say. For your home, Qualtex for your home. Hmm. Well, let's plug it in there. Hmm. I'll power test it. There's one light on. There's a two lights on. That's good. We'll keep it on the... Thank you. 
Yeah, that's warming up nicely. So, there we are. I'm going to practice this heater now, and um, then we can get it on its way. And uh, this I sold for 25. Considering I've spent 10 quid on a thermostat, um, I haven't made a lot of money on this at all. In fact, I'll probably look at a mecha fiver. But still, there we are. Thanks for watching. Bye for now.